All right, I believe we are going at last. So this is the first ever test recording on my new computer. I gotta try a game out. This is one of the handful I have the ISO for. So move the hair out of the way. Nice and relaxed. Yeah, we're recording. The levels seem about right in my tests. The, the PC is running it fine. I have to sort out graphic glitches and stuff like that. You know, gotta be on the safe side with this game. And obviously there are some odd textures and things like that, but I've tested it. The game runs fine. So, as you can see, like I say, bits of graininess, bits of blurriness. Wait till you see the actual game. I'm running at four times native, which I think is 1080p. I've tried recording, uh, not recording, I've tried playing at 4K, I think it is. If I'm correct, it's eight times native in the PlayStation emulator. That, yeah. Yeah, it has no trouble with that. It fucking eats this for breakfast. So, we're gonna watch, we're gonna keep our eyes peeled for any glitches of any kind. Obviously, I need to adjust them, but I have to go out later today. So, I have to get this done as quickly as possible. That looks pretty decent as best as I can tell. I don't know. I'm gonna watch the recording back. I'm probably just gonna bung it up just because I've got the computer going. It's got a few bells and whistles left to add, but it's going. I want to record, I want to show you guys that it's actually up, so yeah, oh yeah, and it, I don't think I introduced myself, if you're new to this or whatever, my name is Grey, welcome to my channel if you're brand new, I finally have a decent gaming rig, and we're going to put it to good use with some PlayStation 2 games to begin with, then I'm going to try different things, I got a few Steam games that someone kindly gave me to run in the new computer, and yeah, it's going to be fun. So, just the one part to begin with, if this goes well, we shall go from there, but blah blah blah, it's fine. Let's get on with the game, more or less. So, you've seen the first cutscene, the quest has begun. Finally! The computer is good. Right, how's the graphics looking? Because I really don't know. I don't know what it's coming through like on the recording. That doesn't look great to me. That doesn't look great at all. I'm just gonna check the settings. At least it's still running. Yeah, give me a minute. I don't know. I'm sure that's fine. Anyway, I'll leave it running for now. But yeah, it's staying at a dead stable 50 frames per second. No problem, the CPU is eating this up, the GPU is enhancing it perfectly. Yeah, we're gonna see. It's finally happening, the game's going. We're playing this on a PlayStation 2 emulator, fully upscaled, like I say, I think it's 1080. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Not interested. What is that on the dark. side? Let's head into town. Why is it funny looking on the There's side? There's better places than this to spend an evening. Alright, something's up. Back in a bit. Alright, okay. I think we're getting there. I think I've sorted it. I don't Shake know for certain lip. yet. We shall wait and see. But that's looking better already. The weird bit on the side is gone. I don't know about the rest of the textures. Maybe I'll play it back. I don't know. But like I say, you're joining me on this. I'm completely new to this. I don't know how to set the games up well. All I know is I can actually hope I to. I can run them well. Before. We're laughing. Beats me. I'm gonna skip all this. Talk, Here we go. Hmm, but yeah, so far, you know? looking great. A low life like Enough dilly dallying. Alright, come on. Come on, game. I want to get to some actual gameplay, it's going to be awesome. Yeah, I'm just going to, in this first part, I'm going to rush through, show you guys whatever bits I can. You know, get the actual gameplay, get the world map. Let's see what it looks like. So, we've got our first fight, here we go. Still staying dead stable. And look how fucking crisp they look. This looks like a PS3 game for crying out loud. Volume's a little loud for my liking, that's fine, that's just tweaking. And you may have noticed, if you uh, had a keen eye while I was blazing through the attack menu, the health bars are a bit off. I don't know what to do about that, but the number is fine, so I'm keeping it there for the time being. I'm certain there's a fix. I'll sort that out between this part and the next part. Okay, so, in case you haven't noticed, if you're here to watch the game played for some reason, not just marveling at the fact I've got a computer I can actually hope to run it, because I'm still completely blown away by that, but... What's going on is, as an evil jester, he has uh, done some sort of curse, we're chasing him. I say we make Here we are. Now. So yeah. The little troll guy apparently is royalty, and the horse is the princess, so there you go. Who thunk it? 
Right, bit more nothing going on. Yeah, some more funny textures, I think. I don't know. I really don't know what the ideal is that I can set this game at. Sky's the fucking limit, really. But at any rate, it is going. So, from now on, I'm going to enjoy the game. I'm just going to focus on that, and we'll deal with everything else later. So, we're coming up on our first town. It's got a fire going, clearly. That's nice. Nighttime. Peaceful time. Yeah. Ooh, gotta try and stay centered in the shot. There we go. Come on, man. <sighs> yeah. Just breathing in that sweet air. You can almost smell it. The graphics are so good. Bit iffy here, but whatever. I'm sure that's just a setting. And if any of you are watching and you actually know what settings I need to change, feel free to say. I would bloody love that. So yeah, as you can tell, the uh, guy that wrote, well not wrote, he drew Dragon Ball, you know, probably did write Dragon Ball, I can't remember, but yeah. All the characters look like Dragon Ball characters, which is pretty cool. I like that. Makes the game come to life. In a Dragon Ball kind of way. So they'll probably just be screaming their heads off and, you know, yelling about how powerful they are and what number it is. Who knows. Right, we're getting there with the game. Come on. The gameplay is about to start. Good horsey. Yeah, that's looking crisp. Yes. This is the top. Hold your horses, granddad. I thought it was Dolmagus we was after. That's the jester. I am That's not your for. granddad. And of course, yep. Dolmagus is our man. You can breathe. Dust. We must track him down. Oh. So yeah, we've been cursed. Just look. And we'd only just settled on her engagement to the prince of Argonia. Remember that bit? It will come in helpful later on in the plot. That's why it's imperative we locate right. I don't know why it starts with a no. Because we're the king's servant. And yet... That's we seem to be quite uh, choosy about what orders we can do. You know, we can pick and choose with his commands. You weren't thinking of going without me. I'm the best there I is was hoping. Alright, there we go. So yeah, like I say, I'm going to rush on with the plot for now. Just skip through a bit. We're going to head up here. We're going to go to the pub, which has the coolest fucking pub music in a game ever. Feel free to, you know, challenge that claim. Let me know what ones you like in games, but this one. This is so cool. Just listen to it. Oh, that's so catchy. So, yep, yeah, got me an antidotal herb, and we get plot progression. Haven't you had enough, Mr. Calderasha, sir? You mean Hercule? Mr. Satan? I'm sorry, but Nearly I said Hercule Poro. This, Definitely not uh, him. Haphazard. Yep. What? My fortune telling? Let me tell you something. I'm the greatest karate master uh, ever. Nah. So what? Uh, yeah, blah blah. Only have led to I'm sorry, Mr. Cole. If you're saying you knew about the file. So he's psychic. Yes. Poor Rylus. Rylus is dead. Let's go talk to him a bit closer. More plot progression. Du -du 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 -du. Da, 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 da. What? So catchy. I dare you. Name me some better pub music you. than that. In a game. Not just like Blair in the pub rock jukebox or whatever. Quick, quick! Everyone come quick! There's a monster in town! Okay! Is he Ron Weasley? And a monster, he says. I He's wonder who that it. could be. The whole town's gone crazy! <laughs> crazy! <laughs> yep. So, as you can see, the voice acting is prime in this game. It's absolutely on the money. Well, you know, it's entertaining, so I can't complain. Yeah, that's it. This part might be a bit longer than usual. It depends how long it takes me to actually get to combat. Just so I can show it off. I'm not going to bother going around town. In every RPG, you can just go around and smash all the boxes, open all the crates, whatever. Get all the items. I'm not going to bother right off the bat. It's not worth the hassle straight away. I will do it, but yeah. 
Here we go. A monster in this end of town. Didn't we park in this end of town? I wonder what the commotion could be. What the? This ain't good, Gav. Come on. Yeah. Look lively. <laughs> Look at the gimp at the back. I guess you should dress however you feel comfortable. He looked at me. Oh! Get out! Get out, monster! You're not welcome here! Love the fucking voice actor. There we go. The princess is very brave. And angry looking. Oh well, there we go. So yeah, they get booted out of town, no problem. <laughs> we're alright. Me and my buddy Angus, we're fine. So we have really? our chat here. Don't they really? hmm. Judging, Judging a book by its yep. cover. Yeah, you can say. So then. Oh, they nearly had a moment. To find Master Rylus? Well, yes and no. What? He's dead? Yup. The drunk man in the pub told me so. Well, uh, I suppose there's no point crying over spilt milk. Or blood. It's Dormagus we're after. He's the one who... I had hoped Rylus might... But it seems we'll just have to track Dormagus down by ourselves. Yeah, you can smell him out. With Rylus gone, we have nothing further to gain from staying here. I think he took it personally Let's with all the rocks. On our way. Well, there wait. we go. Oh, here we go. Please wait. Videl! I'm sorry All right, not quite. I'm after you like this. It's just... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna blitz through this. Not Otherwise, we're not gonna get anywhere. I, I dreamt about you. Some, some people came to a town with that guy. I dreamt. <laughs> She's hoping we can do her a favor. I'm so sorry. <laughs> not to worry. He takes it in his stride. I'm so I haven't even introduced myself. If you could just come She's to Videl. Even it's begins with a V. Way. It's Videl. Come on. Alright, let's go back in there. Was she rabbiting on a bear? She wasn't afraid to look at me. We must give this young girl a... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right then. I couldn't agree more. Let's get the fuck on. You stay out here with the horse and, you know, do nothing. Disappear. Just disappear into nothingness and wait for us to come back. That'll be fine. Right up we go. So yep, I know where the place is. It's right here in the corner of town, hidden away in a back alley behind the pub. Good stuff. Very good place to stay. And she's fallen asleep already. We've gone like 10 seconds. She must be sleepy. Oh well, let's listen to her chat. Ugh. Shoulders are really tight. Ah, I'm so sorry. I, I, mu I wanted yes, to ask you a favor. Yes, it was rude. It was terrible. Sorry. I'm getting ahead of Please course. do. My father, Galdar, lost treasure. He was a famous people, karate chop man. One day, he lost his... It's probably because he stopped using... <gasps> Valentina. Uh-oh. Look at all his piss. What? <laughs> I do yeah, like I say, I'm just blitzing through. I'm not interested in the plot too much. We will get to that in the next part. For now, I'm just sort of making sure everything records all right. So I want to check out the main bits of combat. And like I said, there are going to be some glitches. Each PlayStation 2 game needs setting up individually so, to run properly. But, and I'm not very good with that. I wanted to ask... There we go. I'll bring the ball back. So Gives me a good opportunity to stretch out the game and try out some different glitches. So yeah, I say I'll try to fix those as best as I can. I know there's one in the cave with the torch being a bit funny. I think the one with the text was sorted, that seems fine. The graphics itself and the actual game look fine. Yeah, it just, yeah. Hopefully it looks alright on the recording, that's what I'll be checking. Right, out we go, I think. Yeah, we go and have a word with him again. Here we go. How's he gonna take it? Hmm. What? Magnificent! Like a prick. And this Calderashag, then we'll kill two birds with one. The time's getting yep. on. Yep. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stay, but you He's quite right. The He's always the right. The time is getting on. We leave. There we go. Right. Let's go back in. We sleep, and then we go outside. We get training. 
As with any good RPG, grinding is an element here, and we need to do lots, otherwise we're going to get our asses handed to us. And there's not enough items about to pick apart and sell. Oh fuck, don't. No, 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 no. Good. Right, so yeah. Dun, dun. The music is fucking epic on this game as well. It's just great. Right, so we're going outside. I hope the levels are about right with everything. Shift this up a little bit so I can have a look. Ooh. Yeah, they seem okay. Right, so yeah, like I say, one of the main glitches, the writing, it looks fine. That's cool. So yeah, the health bars suck on the settings I got. I don't know if I can fix that. But for now, we're just going to wander about and train. But yeah, the game itself is looking pretty damn crisp. There we go, turn it down a bit. Yeah, you see what I mean about the health bars? Other than that though, it's all good. And yeah, you can see how much damage we're going to take if we're actually fighting a fair few of these enemies. So yeah, we're staying very, very close to February, I think it's called. The first town. Yep. All good. Ooh! We got a drop on the first fight. You, If you've played this game, you'll know how rare decent drops are. Now, that wasn't exactly a decent drop, but anything at the start is good. But yeah, trying to steal stuff. Don't bother. Pretty fucking low. Mind you, if I can get a frame skip on this, that might make it worth the trying. Anyway, more slimes. We'll kill them, no problem. But yeah, I'm just blown away by how crisp the game is looking. It looks really good. Once more, don't know about all the textures, but yeah. So, just trying to actually talk about the game and not keep harping on about the graphics. Because I'm that blown away with the fact that I can emulate this now. Because I was going to get a capture card and do it with the PS2 and stuff, but there's no point. Because this kicks the shit out of it graphically, and I can use save states. So it allows me to do the parts with that in mind, you know? I don't have to worry about saving and stuff. Yeah, it's just really good looking overall. Right, so I got the shit beat out of me. I need to heal. This heals 30 HP, and you may have noticed I've only got 22, which is not that good, but, you know. We'll get better. I'm not going indoors just to heal after a couple of fights. So yeah, we'll fight a couple more guys, and that'll probably do it for this first part. If they ever appear. There we go. Alright, a couple more. Now the guy on the right can just sit there licking his face, so we're just going to focus on the kebab. Aww. He's letting me down. Right, there we go. And again. Yeah, I don't know why the health bars are like that. Probably a very technical reason. Oh, now you get a crit. Come on. Candy Cat. You are going down, my friend. There we go. Yeah, I'm turning it down a little bit more. It's quite loud in my ears. So yeah, and for the first couple of levels, you don't get any points to level up with, which is too bad, but we do get stronger, so we'll bear that in mind. I'm figuring using the save states will make it easier for leveling up the stats with the seeds you get, that, you know, they bump up stats. That'd be pretty cool. Gotta remember not to venture too far away from the door, otherwise I'll have to run all the way back here and probably die painfully on the way. Oh well. Right, lips. You are going down. One enemy at a time suits me very well in this early stage. Good! Another one dead. Very good. Ooh, two whole experience points. Try not to break the fucking bank with that. And again, no skill points, just leveling. I do like the skill system in this, I do. You get some really cool moves, it's just really nice. I don't know what it is about it exactly, it's just really, really cool. Alright, keep going man, keep going. We are nearly done for this first part though, but like I say, it is running fine. If I can set it up properly, even better, but the game itself is running great. I just wanted to get something recorded so that you guys could see the new computers up and going. And yeah, feel free to suggest games with that in mind. I should be able to run basically anything on the market, providing I can afford it. So yeah. Here we go, another one dead. Yeah, we'll do one more fight, and then we'll call it here. 
One more. Come on. Make it a big one. Make it count. Go out on a high. Come on. Yeah, this looks great. I thought it looked awesome on the PlayStation 2, but yeah, it looks even better here. No questions. Alright, there we go. Yeah, we just kill these two and then we're good. We'll take another turn unless he gets a critical. Come on, Yangus, do it. Let me down, man. Wish I had my Charmander from Pokemon Blue with me. He always got crits. Right. Ah, but you pulled through in the end. Alright, so cool, that'll do it. Let's finish this up. Plenty of XP, plenty of gold for this point. So yeah, that is pretty much it. We have... This is the first part of Dragon Quest VIII. I'm probably going to do a whole playthrough because I fucking love this game. And I haven't done a proper RPG yet. I've only done the Pokemon games. So I don't know how to go about it with editing. I have editing tools now that can actually do the job decently. So, yeah. Let me know what you think, how I should approach it. Should I just record the lot and upload it straight? Should I cut out the grindy bits? Should I do whatever? And again, suggest games and stuff. This is the first part of a new playthrough. I've still got all the old bits to from my laptop to upload properly. That will take a while. But yeah, I'm going to be starting with this new computer when I get back from being out of town. But yeah, this is the first part. I'm just so fucking psyched that I've finally got it done. I actually fucking nutted up and bought the damn thing. And here we go. So yeah, I had a good sleep. This is a good day. That is part one of Dragon Quest VIII and my first ever video with my new machine. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it to whatever degree. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next video and hopefully many in the years to come. So see you then. Have a good day. Bye.